Hello and uh, welcome back to Bomber Crew for uh, the third episode. Um, some of you seem to be liking this, so I uh, thought I'd play a bit more. <laughs> so yeah, here we are, RAF Woodbridge, um, and um, we're we're going to go and look at some crew gear that we've unlocked. So let's have a wee look. What did we manage to unlock in some crew gear? Oh, everybody's got something to unlock, so that might be nice. Might get something good. Uh, okay, headgear. Um, oh, okay, so I've unlocked a few here. So helmet mark one. Um, which would give them a bit less speed, but uh, more armor and more thermal. So that's pretty cool. Get more of that service cap, which will give us loads more speed, uh, but less armor. Pilot's cap, which would give us um, less armor, more survival. <laughs> interestingly enough, uh, flak helmet number. Oh, we get wow. That's a that's pretty cool. So that's ten more points in armor uh, just for a flak helmet, which is pretty awesome. Uh, and one more point in thermal, but 6% uh, less in speed. So what's that in comparison to the f helmet mark 1 and the flak helmet mark 1? Okay, so they, yeah, flak helmet mark 1, definitely better for them. Um, and that would cost us 1,050 to give them all the flak helmet. So let's uh, let's think about that. Um, so 1,050 for the flak. Um, what else can we get? We've got oxygen, which I guess is a tough and small bottle, which means that um, let's see, they're going to get uh, two more armor, interestingly. Um, okay, so the bottle's just tougher. <laughs> uh, it takes a lot of the speed and actually gives them less oxygen time, interestingly. So it's tougher in that they uh, they, they can, uh, it probably won't get broken. But um, yeah, it gives them less time, so I'm not really worried about that. Gloves, what have we got? Ooh, leather gloves. Leather gloves gives them two more armor, uh, five less thermal though, um, but more chance of survival. Okay, so that's not too bad. Oh, what has Mary Alexander managed to unlock? Headgear as well, something different. Oh, you got headphones. <laughs> Those are some seriously large headphones. Okay, um, that's interesting. So if I give you a flak helmet, um, yep. So you're still going to get the same out of that. I think I'd quite like to armor everybody up a lot, um, but I've noticed that the aircraft also has some unlocks. So let's, I think our decision for crew gear is definitely the flat helmet for everybody at 1050. But let's go and look at the aircraft because we've obviously not got a lot of money left. Um, let's see what we can do with regards to, uh, so livery, I'm not going to be too worried about what else have we unlocked. Ooh, cat's eyes. Oh, huh, that's decidedly ugly. So uh, nope. Um... <laughs> Wing art, that'll be... Oh, round. What have we got? Oh, roundels. Nice. Um, do you know what? Let's put some roundels on it. Probably makes it easier for people to target us, but whatever. <laughs> I think it looks cool. Um, so that's fine. Waste text. Oh, we've got yellow text now as well. Um, eh, I quite like the, the white text. I'm sure the yellow text looks pretty good, but, um, you know, if you if, if anyone wants to change some of this, you know, the, the look of it, just fire something in the comments. I'm pointing down here as if I'm on stream. Fire something in the comments. Um... Streaming, by the way, on Fridays and Sundays. Uh, Fridays at 8pm on twitch.tv forward slash Edinburgh Fudge. And Sundays at 3pm uh, on twitch.tv slash Edinburgh Fudge. Um, just a wee plug in there. Um, also follow me on Instagram. Um, yeah, and follow me here on YouTube. Subscribe. Um, I think that's pretty much all my... Yeah, anyway, let's move on. So, livery we've done. Uh, okay, so engines uh, we can get... Oh, we can get an armoured engine. So, um, that gives us... Um, uh, an increase in weight, but it also gives a massive increase in armor. Um, so armored engines can take more damage, but don't increase the aircraft's weight as much, weight limit as much. Okay, and then the standard engine two gives us also the same amount of. Okay, so the standard engine mark two gives us the same as an armored engine in armor. Sorry, no, it does not. It gives us less, but. It also gives us a bit more of a weight limit increase because we've got better engines. Mm, so I'd quite like to get this, the armored engine Mark II, but I also don't want to because uh, obviously the weight limit increase gives us a lot more of a weight limit to that we can lift. So if we, for example, if we want to do yeah, so you can obviously do a lightweight fuselage, um, but we're not really wanting to do it. We're probably going to go for the armored Mark II fuselage at some point. Fuselage, fuselage, fuselage. Yeah, that. The, the, the bit in the middle. Um, so everything's armoured currently, which I think is as good as we can get just now. Um, so it is tempting to get some new engines. Uh, how much are these? Okay, so a thousand for a standard 
uh, Mark II engine or 1750 for the Mark One. So this would give us um, this would give us more lift capacity, but I, I do kind of want to hold out for the armored Mark II engine. So that's a bit of a risk holding out, but I think we'll hold out and we'll go back to the crew gear and we'll give them a bit more health, and that'll be hopefully enough to um, enough to keep them safe for long enough. <laughs> Just all over the shop, right? Um, crew gear. Let's we're gonna give you all. Uh, some new headgear then with a new flak helmet so everybody gets a new flak helmet and now everybody is armoured a lot better which is pretty cool um, excellent training wise have we got anything to um, add to their training let's just have a wee quick look ok so we can choose a primary skill for the pilot let's just go for emergency dive again oh quite like the corkscrew idea though what was the corkscrew? It can avoid incoming enemy fire if used with good timing. I think we'll go for an emergency dive because that can uh, you can you can quickly get to somewhere um, for putting out engine fires, which is pretty cool. Um, let's see um, the primary skill for the engineer. We could go lean, um, or we can do boost. Um, we could boost. We could use boost to get away from people if we know we've got enough um, fuel. So we'll go for boost for just now. Uh, custom heading I'm going to leave because I don't really want to use one of those. Radio for beacon, we might as well use it since they've unlocked it. Um, Finley's going to use focus. Aitken's going to use focus. And um, Harvey Cunningham has not managed to um, unlock anything on the bomb aimer yet. So obviously need to do more bombing with you, um, Harvey, um, to get you better at your job. Um, okay, cool. So let's um, jump out of the training uh, and let's head into a briefing. Let's see what our next mission is. Uh, okay, so we've got the mission to search and rescue, um, which we do have an enemy ace in the area, so that's kind of a difficult one, but um, I think that was the same beforehand, so we could have done that. This other option is a critical mission. Okay, so we will be supporting a daring commando raid on the impenetrable U-boat base at San Nazaire. I think that's what that's called, that says. They will ram the base in a ship pack with explosives before disembarking and detonating the charges. That'll be quite a show. My word. Okay, so we could go and do that one. I'm guessing, given that that's a critical mission, it probably makes sense that we do that one. Um, so we get basically um, basically three grand for completing with a safe return. Um, what do we get for... I feel bad for our Spitfire pilot, um, but I have a sneaking suspicion if we don't do the critical one. Um, that we won't get the same chance at that again. So, yeah, it looks like we're going to begin a mission and we're going to leave that poor pilot um, all by themselves. So, um, right, let's give this one a go. And, uh, yeah, let's uh, critical mission, Operation Chariot. Head to the commando ship rendezvous point at Falmouth. Okay, let's take off then, please. Uh, we're going to give you a new heading, which is over this way. There we go. Uh, we'll go to the pilot again because we'll bring up the landing gear once we're up. There we go. Let's ray that gear and let's go to a medium altitude for just now. And that'll do us for the new. Um, and we did get, we've got a heading on board, haven't we? Yeah, okay. So um, let's just fast forward that then until we get ourselves to a new heading. We're just going to join the bomb boat to begin with. Um, navigation is difficult through the cloud. Okay, right. So straight. Oh my word. Okay, so we've got problems. So let's uh, let's not fast forward. Let's take you and let's go. Uh, let's go for an emergency dive, because um, I am very much worried about all of the problems that this plane seems to have. Um, so let's go for you, and you need to go and fix everything basically. Let's start off with the oxygen because I think that's probably more important than anything else. Um, yeah, good to see that the plane um, completely destroyed itself straight away, um, given that we haven't even started yet. That's uh, the second time that I think that's happened, so that's frustrating, but anyway, there we go. Um, so we'll get that and then after that we'll get some, is this hydraulics or something possibly? Come on, speedy speedy, to get this fixed before we join the bomb boat. Um, which at this rate we might be um, not doing that anyway. Well, we will be joining the bomb boat. We'll be joining the bomb boat with broken stuff already. Um, okay, let's go and fix this one, please. Uh, this person can't see, I don't think, which is partly because there's no cloud. Uh, sorry, partly because there's too much cloud. Um, are we at a low altitude? I think we are. Oh no, we've reached mid altitude again. Great, okay. Um, so in that case, let's go to a low altitude then. 
Ah, so they took the emergency dive, and then in the process after the emergency dive, then um, then uh, moved back up to the medium altitude. So that was interesting. So they kind of got away. We could have got away from a fighter, and we could have got away from um, taking out the. Oh, we've got a new repair, which is great. That person's completed that one. So let's go back to your station, please. And navigation update required. Yep, but we don't have any navigation yet, so we can't really do that. Hopefully. This person shall find out where they're going. Uh, can't give you a custom if I don't know where it is. So hopefully we're going in the right direction. <coughs> there we go. Finally marked a heading. That's only taken us a little bit of time. Okay, so we've already had problems and all we've, got, <laughs> we've not even managed to join the bomb boat yet. Okay, so we are to defend this. Well, first things first then. Let's enemy fighter spotted on the radar. Let's go. Uh, came out of that by mistake. Where are they? There they are. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's see if we've got any more fighters on the radar. So first things first, let's get you on focus just now. Let's try and take out as many of these as possible. Stay with the ship. I think I am staying with the ship. Yep, figured that might need a second one. So I'll have to head this way. Wow, we've taken out another bundle of uh, planes there. Ah, what we do need to do is we do need to upgrade that top section's um, top gunner's um, actual gun. Uh, we have been given a new heading, I believe. Oh, someone's out of ammo. Who's out of ammo? You go and reload quickly. Thankfully, he's right beside it, so that's fine. Okay, where are we now? Let's see. Yep. Doing well here. Let's can we? Yeah, we're still guarding that ship, so let's just <coughs> head over here. Oh, we've got a target in 20 seconds to take out, which looks to me like it's a submarine, um, which is interesting because that's not going to give us any time at all to get this done. Eight seconds left. Will we have enough to actually get it done? Three. Two, one, let's release early. Not sure if we got that or not. Uh, that's six seconds, we're not getting that one. Let's get this one. Oh, that's going to be right beside the ship. That's going to get torpedoed. But oh, not good. Right, select the next set of bombs. Okay, let's get this one before they get to near to this one then, hopefully. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Now, oh, another torpedo. Um, let's see, I need to. Okay. Oh, those other submarines are backing off. Save the rest of your bombs for gun emplacements. Okay. I'm going to leave the bomb bay doors open because I have a sneaking suspicion we're going to be fairly quick in here. One of your gun turrets is low on ammo. Who's low on ammo? You can go and reload. You go and reload. And I'll leave you in there for just now. Oh dear, we did not get those fighters. Um, got two of them there, but we do need... There's another third one. Ah, there we go. Somewhere. That's what I was going to say. Okay, we managed to target them. That's good. Um, we'll give you focus. Uh, let's just get this target for just now. So if we can give you... Uh, okay, someone's actually gone past you, so that's not going to do us any good now. you focus and give you focus and try and take them out. I think we need to look at the bomber. Let's select another set of things. Are we going in the right direction? We are indeed. That's always a good start. Um, yep, taken. Oh, nice. 125 points for taking out that one. That's pretty good. Okay, I think we're going to get... Yeah, so we need to do that one and then immediately on a different heading. So let's go quickly... Bomb this, and then quickly into this heading over here. Uh, 
let's see. We could head back over here. Yeah, I think we kind of want to... We definitely want to try and stick with this one. Oh, jeez. Mark these all up as soon as I can. Try and give our guys a chance to actually do anything about it. Right, let's go over here then. Because I think we're... Yeah, we're saving this person all right just now. Let's give you focus. And you focus. No, 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 no. Wrong person. Come on. Reload. Right, we need you. Oh, oh, we didn't have anything selected. Dang it. Need to head back to that one. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, let's see if we can get this one selected. Oh, things are not going well down here. Oh, that doesn't look very good. Okay, let's. Oh dear. Destroyed the ship. Oh no. Well, that did not go well. Uh, so let's head back. Well, I don't know how they destroyed the ship, but uh, we did not do very well. So that's not very good. So let's uh, close the doors and let's just get going. We're low on fuel. Oh dear. Uh, that is not good. Somebody's out of ammo. Uh, okay, well, we're not doing too well here. Let's see, everybody's health wise is fine, but um, yeah, we need to. You need to go out and fix that one. You need to reload. You need to reload. You need to get back in here. Um, can I give you focus for just now and see if there's anything that needs to go on? We just need to try and get back to base. Oh, we need to. Uh, what we needed to be doing was lean, but we can't do lean, can we? Because we did. Uh, yeah, we did. Um, we didn't manage to make them do lean, did we? Okay, so let's hope that we can get care back into this space and uh, they can do something about the fuel but I don't think they will be able to somehow uh, oh lean there we go yes we have just managed to uh, so that one's empty so yeah we're, we're running on pretty much empty here as well so we're running full lean to get home let's see how that works Yeah, okay. Seven minutes remaining. Let's see if we can get ourselves home. We didn't manage to defend the ship, but um Yeah, let's see. Okay, who how is everybody else? So let's uh let's you go and take some medic. Um just enough to then you can head back in here once you've got some health back. Gain health back so slowly. Okay. Yeah, we'll just leave that because we need to we need to get you in the right place. Um, where are we? ETA, 3 minutes and 10 seconds. Okay. Next waypoint now. Quick, 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 quick. So we've got 3 minutes is our ETA. And how much? 6 minutes of fuel. Ooh. That's a close one. So we couldn't have stayed out there for much longer. So even if we did uh, try and defend the ship, it would have been a bit of a struggle um, to do that. So yeah, that's a that's a shame. That um, yeah, I am very much aware we are low on fuel. Don't worry. <laughs> uh, yeah, you gotta you gotta keep this one lean. I'm afraid. Um, ah well, um, that didn't go quite as well as I would hoped. But um, please tell me it's not three minutes to the next. 2 minutes and 30 seconds, it wasn't... Yeah, okay, that's fine. Uh, I think that was definitely ETA to home, so... Yeah, you can see we're across the channel now. At least we're getting back into the right land. And uh, I can see ground, 96%. Okay. Yep, so... Um, yeah, bit of a shame, but... Um, we'll see how... Uh, you can see we've got absolutely torn up. Look at that. And that's with the added... Uh, that's with the added armour as well. Need to get these headings done really, really quickly. Um, thankfully, the the weather's pretty bad, but it's yeah. Um, everybody's managed to we've managed to keep everyone. I think the armor uh, armored fuselage has definitely been a massive bonus. Uh, we 
<laughs> we need a new engine because uh, that did not go well. We kind of did think that you know the unarmored engines weren't going to go well though, but I'm just hoping that we can. Um, let's see. Let's just speed this one up. Um, got a new heading. Hopefully this will be enough to just get us uh, back home. Beautiful. Let's get the pilot. Ro lower the gear. And then how are we doing on fuel? What on earth is going on there? Yeah, I know we're low on fuel, but dancing around in circles is not going to help us. Fuel, zero minutes left. Oh my god. I think we just ran out of fuel. <gasps> How's about that for timing? Run out of fuel as we land. So we couldn't have stayed a second longer to help... Uh... <laughs> okay. Yeah, mission failed. Sad times. Um, okay. Well, we've returned and repaired, but uh, yeah, that, that... No money for us, huh? Everyone returned though, right? Yeah, everyone returned, so we, we managed to keep everyone alive, which to me is the most important part, because I'm, you know, break the plane all you want. I'm okay with the rest of it. Um, right. So, um, sadly, we're going to have to end on that. Um, so, uh, yeah, we haven't managed to unlock anything. Um, and we're going to have to head back and do another mission next time. But um, thank you very much for watching. Sadly, my uh, small failure this time. Uh, but we'll come back stronger next time. And hopefully we won't break our uh, wing off when we land. And we'll maybe have some fuel. And we'll maybe save the day. Uh, yeah. Thanks very much for watching. Oh, and we'll also put a better gun on that turret. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Cheers. Bye-bye.